Hola, soy Carmen Pérez, directora del Instituto de Conservación y Restauración de Bienes Culturales y me gustaría invitarles a conocer las actividades que llevamos a cabo. La Generalitat Valenciana hizo una gran apuesta por esta institución cuando la creó por ley en 1999 y se puso en funcionamiento en el 2005. Las infraestructuras con las que nos dotó eh, la Generalitat son de última generación, con dos sedes, la principal que es la sede de Castellón, ubicada en el complejo eh, sociocultural de Peñeta Rocha, y eh, la sede de Valencia, que está ubicada en, en la calle Genaro La Huerta, en las dependencias de la antigua Escuela de Artes y Oficios. Espero que disfruten con nosotros recorriendo el centro y viendo que para un restaurador su trabajo es algo importante. Procuramos que no se pierdan estas huellas del pasado y eh, nuestro trabajo realmente nos apasiona. The Institute is the managing organ of the preservation and investigation of the Comunidad Valenciana historical legacy. The operating principles are based on obtaining the best knowledge of each piece while respecting the work of art through minimal intervention and maximum reversibility. In addition to services in restoration and research, perform preventive conservation tasks, formation and diffusion in institutions that guard the heritage as museum, churches, archives and libraries. The Institute has technical resources with vanguard facilities and a large interdisciplinary team of experts in fields such as restoration, art history, archaeology, physics, chemistry, photography, didactics planning, and coordination and project management, all committed to a common objective, to research, preserve, and disseminate our cultural heritage. This legacy ranged from the footsteps of our distant past as paleontological and geological remains, or Mediterranean cave paintings, to contemporary art from Valencia. The outstanding research work provides a broad field of study continuously updated. The works are diagnosed by non-destructive studies from innovative imaging techniques such as infrared reflectography, ultraviolet, X-rays, CT, 3D scanner, studies of microsamples with light and electron microscopy. The study of the degradation of materials in the Chamber of Control Aging facilitates prior his evolution. These resources allow detailed analysis of the constituent materials and their conservation status, being a key support for subsequent restoration and preservation. The quality of projects has enabled agencies to work actively with national and international prestige. Beside research projects, the Valencian Institute of Conservation and Restoration links via cooperation projects with developing countries to train technicians who practice and put this knowledge into practice. With this broad perspective, the Institute acquired an international project on with the intention of both to spread the heritage of Valencia as well to bring in and raise awareness in the community the legacy of other cultures. 
The constant national and international cooperation makes possible an intensive training activity for the expertise of heritage professionals through courses, seminars, conferences and congresses. Social awareness of heritage values and the didactic approach of the restoration is another objective of the Institute. This develops graphics and audiovisual material, conferences, guided tours and workshops to involve future generations in the conservation of heritage. Because heritage is rich and great wealth, to give and who is coming is returned to full force as a security for the future of the Comunidad Valenciana and thus the history of mankind. <laughs>